When your phone is your life, the worst thing you can do is lose it. As I sat in front of gate one, emptying out my purse and going hysterically crazy, only to find out that it was in my jacket the whole time. Yes, insert your hysterical laugh here. Raptors home openers are a tradition and my favorite time of year. But for some reason, this one was really subdued. Maybe because the Raptors could not buy a bucket to save their life. And the fans were doing the wave instead of cheering for legitimate reasons. The calls, of course, did not go the Toronto Raptors way. You'd think that the lockout would have solved problems rather than create more of them. Aside from Tyler Hansborough looking clueless on the basketball court, Roy Hibbert was showing us some fancy moves to the basket, and Danny Granger hit dagger after dagger down the stretch for the Indiana Pacers. Only if we could have played a medley of Justin Beamer songs that would have allowed him to hop up off his courtside seat and help the Toronto Raptors because he does have some skill. He is going to be cast in a new basketball movie coming out soon. DeMar, who is a big fan of the Beats and the new face of the franchise in my eyes, did get it going late in the fourth quarter as he nailed 16 of his 22 points in that frame. And I was stunned with the crowd in the fourth quarter as they chanted MVP for Andrea Bargnani. But he does have a lot to learn this season, especially on the defensive end of the floor. It will be his true test to see if he is really worth number one after six seasons in the league. I guess a great pickup for the Indiana Pacers in just two games has been the two-time NBA All-Star David West as he took less money to get more touches. While you live and you learn, and up next to the Toronto Raptors, a true test against Dwayne Casey's former team, the Dallas Mavericks, the world champion Dallas Mavericks who have dropped three straight. Let's just hope the Raptors don't fumble and fumble and fumble again. Let's hope that they get a victory. Until next time from inside the Purple Room, I'm Pyle and I'll see you again.